You have been doing some awesome networking with this is our longest meeting of the year with the largest crowd of the year. Amber's got a lot of stuff to say. And his usually his data and statistics is like last month old. Got something in there as of this afternoon. So you're getting bleeding edge information here. It's nothing but the best for our guys. Hey, welcome to Realty Investors Group or RIG or IIG. Call us anything. We call us a late dinner. Glad you are here. We've been doing this for since 2012, helping investors make money together. I am Jim. Oh, I said that didn't. I'm a little nervous. I'm a little tight strong because tonight, normally I'll hang out, JH and David, I'll sit in the park a lot so the cat, Kelly and the crew is gone. But tonight, I'm going to go, good night, I love you, and I'm going to run out the door because if our car, if our driver's here, Dave and I, we, we got to catch a plane tonight. Leave it in on the chip. Yeah. Anyway, I digress. We're going downhill. We're going downhill fast. Somebody come in. Come on up here and get your name tag. Grab a bag. Don't worry about me. Don't worry about the guy behind the curtain. We are just getting started. I think everybody's got this by now. Red up. I'm hungry. I'm thirsty. Green. I'm good. Go away. Hey, Valentine's Day. Today is what? The day of love. And what better way to kind of celebrate it than have something that represents love? I was told I should dress up as Cupid. It's like Santa Claus, I can do. Father Time, I can do. Cupid, you don't want to see this in a diaper. So I talk, I took a quick I swindled Kyle and Miss Shauna into doing. Romeo and Juliet here. Thank you, the ones that's got the cards, and they're going to help pass out the bag. But we digressed a little bit, but I asked them to come and be Romeo and Juliet because it's like, what better as a symbol of love? And she goes right up to death, and I go, and that's what the life insurance kicks in. They do insurance, so it's perfect, perfect. Okay, moving right along. And a couple of our speakers have already said they're young single guys. It's like, you know how, what kind of hot water you got me in by spending work at night? So, yeah. I'm going to spit the stuff out as fast as possible so they can do their skill. They can take care of their sweeties. They won't get manfred up here. Due diligence. You may hear about a good deal. You may hear about Joe Bob. He's the greatest person that's ever walked on water, whatever. Regardless of what you hear, ask around the room, do your own due diligence. Research the property, research the company, research the people. Please. Yep. We're all over the web. We're back on Meetup. We were, we got off. We're back up on Meetup. But this is a lot more fun than any of that online stuff. Clubhouse. How many people know about Clubhouse? It's an awesome tool to get on there and learn. There's some crazy stuff on there, but there's some good stuff. That's how I met Miss Tracy here tonight. And she is my Valentine date tonight. Yes. We made that arrangement on the live clubhouse chat. A mutual friend was like, I can't believe you just asked the girl on clubhouse to be your Valentine Day. Why not? Because you're married. I'm safe as can be. We're going to hang out. I'm leaving. She's going that way. I'm going out of the country. So. Welcome to our first time guest. How many here for the first time? Right. First time. Is it anything about this young guy called Manfred? The reason you're here? Glad to have you. First time guests for free. We love having first time people. Uh, if you like us and want to come back, kind of like uh, Miss Jen did back there, you'll leave, we'll either ask you to pay a $20 membership, uh, $20 per meeting fee, or join the membership for $100. That's five meetings a year, and you're making money. And that is our newest brick member sitting back there. So welcome back, Jen. If you uh, want to partner with somebody and save a little bit of money, significant other, business partner, Husband, wife, whatever, you save a little bit of money. If you have a business for two fifty, you can sign up, and everybody in your business gets to come under your umbrella. And every month, we I don't know, I start to say a reach in the hat, but I pick a business member every month, and we bring them up front, and we let them talk about their services. And tonight is no different. Tonight we have Mini Build Inc. Guys, you want to come on up to the front?
Any no. Big buttons forward, the little button back. Right, thanks, Jeff. Right. Hang on, up hands, microphone. Here, I can do this. Hello. I'll press it along to this. He's going to turn. All right. Happy Valentine's Day. sensation. Well, happy Valentine's Day, everybody. Um, we kind of wanted to keep this a little short and sweet. Um, the girlfriend is interrupted as well. So I wanted to open up with a quick, simple question. How many people know someone or have been hurt personally by a GC or subcontractor? Straight hands. All right, that's so just more people than I expected. So I've already been told you. We can name a few if you want. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, for sure. Let's exchange numbers later. Right? But, anyways, so here's the idea. Here's where we came. Here's what we started as a company. We realized we were doing our own flips, we realized we were doing our own bids, our own builds, and we had some great crews. But you're not always running, you're not always operating. You can only use a drywall guy for so many days before you, you know, pass them off to someone else. What happens? They go off, they leave the state. I get busy with another job. It's not great. It's hard to keep that pool of talent consistent. So we decided to start sharing our pools. We have about 16 flips going on at any time. And we always have crews ready to go. And we have crews that we've used embedded on our own job sites. It's made a big difference in the quality of work we're able to produce, not to mention the whole time that we have on our overall job sites. We're able to do that by vetting them out and that's where you take over. Yeah. Start. You got to start never telling us that for your brothers. Or... Uh, why does it the second person to say that it's not? Years, there's uh, that's 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 um, yes, kind of as Jeremiah was saying, we've developed a, a platform. Um, we're currently going to be testing the mobile app, but you know, I'm not a tech guy, so I'm not waiting for an app before we start offering our services and getting to work. We essentially created a network where we verify all of our contractors, all of our builders. A lot of these guys we've used ourselves as it grows. Of course, the network's gonna have to kind of validate itself. The network meaning people like you all that would be using them, us, and kind of sharing that. I like to make a comparison of like Home Advisor, but for picks and flippers and real estate investors, Home Advisor currently is really meant for just homeowners. Um, you're wasting their time a lot of times. Homeowners don't know what these cost. We're different in that sense, but we know our numbers. And really what we do is we train all of our contractors to understand the different phases of construction. So as we need to be um, in, you know, enlightened and intelligent investors, having our contractors also understand the process um, and understanding what needs to be done at each phase is important. So what we do is we bring in our contractors, you'll have a flip, you can engage us as early as looking for deals or once you have a deal, we'll send our contractors out there and they'll walk the property with you we developed like an easy to use form for them to create an estimate uh, to give you a fairly accurate price uh, on the spot. And then what we do is that we coach them through um, providing them the right contracts and understanding for both for both ends that you're not gonna give your contract your 50% upfront because you're on a huge risk of this disappearing. So we coach even the contractors and you as the investors if this is your first time to understand that you need to set clear payment milestones and payment schedules that protect the both of you. So we kind of serve as like that intermediary, like escrow company in a sense where you would pay through our platform. We wouldn't release the funds until you have approved the work, but then the contractor can be assured that, hey, the money is in the account. I just got to perform as agreed upon in order to get that payment released. Beyond that, we've also helped create like a little crutch or training, you know, to the task list, I'd say, where you can kind of walk through a flip from acquisition to construction and completion. Um, it's a checklist that's available both in English and Spanish. So if you don't speak Spanish, a lot of the guys that we work with do. I mean, at the end of the day, they all speak construction. We tell them, hey, frame, they understand what that is. And if it's a wall, they know they need to do a wall. So a lot of the guys, you know, you got to meet them where they are. They are Hispanic, they do speak Spanish as, as a first language, so we help them with a, a bilingual kind of platform and task list. Kind of touched on this already, you know, paying by phase and paying by my, milestone is important. Uh, we also have tra track the lead releases and receipts, so you know that's kind of hard, especially if you're dealing with like a bank draw or with a hard money lender, you're going to need to have all your invoices or your um, lead releases in a row. Some lenders are a little more lenient with that than others, but we want to kind of have you know best practices in place that as soon as you pay them our platform will generate the receipt and the lead release you know going 
beyond just the construction, this is a little, you know, add-on service. We do help with some material ordering, material tracking. I'm sure you guys are all aware of, you know, the Home Depot discounts that you can get. Um, there's Lowe's, there's Wayfair, there's Amazon. We've kind of, you know, to do trial and error and honestly just spending too much money at Home Depot, realize that they actually sell door hardware for 50 bucks at Home Depot that you can buy for 15 on Amazon. Same thing, off-brand, but looks just as good. So little things like that can help you save money, you know, on your overall project. And then again, this is more punch list, understanding, you know, the blue tape walkthrough, we kind of coach contractors to do that as well. Sometimes at anywhere from 10 to 20% of the last payment gets retained as long as the blue punch list walkthrough gets complete. Um, you know, we have a specific list, again, available in English and Spanish to help you kind of coach them through that and also coach yourself if you're getting that done. Are you bilingual? Yes, I am. Yes, I, I am. So I am your uh, your human translator when required. Um, but again, the platform is pretty straightforward. We use other people API translators. So whenever you message people on there, it automatically translates to English and Spanish. So you really get to communicate. I've seen people use it live while they stand next to each other when they can't find the word. And they can communicate that way because, again, they all speak construction. They all speak contractors. So um, kind of meet them again where, where they are at. Last thing I want to add is uh, perform the cream. So if you're on a job site, you're kind of unsure about it, just call us. We're happily run the numbers, so sending lots of photos. And uh, that's it. That's it. Thank you. Thanks. 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 I, I think I should start holding our meeting on holidays and by seeing those speakers up here. They can do it, spit it out, and get on with it. So, thanks, guys, for coming. Uh, for those of you who snuck in and didn't come up and get your name tag and goodie bag, please do. Each bag has something a little different. There are some things in there that it's only good here tonight, or at least when I'm here. Rick members will know what I'm talking about. We play this morning every month. It's morning, morning, morning. If you hang out with successful people, they will brainwash you and believe in, you, in yourself and thinking you can achieve anything. We've got some real serious winners in this room in our group. They're out there rocking it left and right, and they're doing it. So now what we're going to do is you get to hear from those people, and you get time to come up here. And if you say, well, I'm just here with my friend, my husband, my boyfriend, girlfriend, it doesn't matter. The saying is, if you eat, you got to speak. Or if you drink, you got to speak. If you're here, we want you to speak. But because look around, we got a full room. We're going to get men for all the time in the world. So. I hate to do this, but I have a timer tonight. All right. What we're going to do is go, my name is, and I specialize in, I need, I can provide, and my phone number is. Spell out that phone number slowly, loudly, clearly, because there's actually people here that write it down, and they may contact you back in. Ow! We're going to start with you, and I know you're going to burn this timer up, but here we go. <laughs> yes, my name is Al Prince, and I've been in the Real estate game since 87, got licensed as a real estate broker, put my first unit in service in 79, and have pretty much liquidated my real estate and got into crypto. And you're going to hear about crypto a little bit later, but I have a technology now that x rays the earth for uh, minerals, oil, gas, natural gas. Being an He was part of the ink. He used to work together. He still hangs out with me. Take it away, Steve. Wait a second. Go. He's got a he's still eating. There you go. All right, go. My name is Steve Estel. Um, I'm a business consultant. I help people with strategies to enhance the overall cash flow on their business. I have a lot of specialized tax incentives. So if you own real estate specifically, um, let's say you spent half a million or more on your property, um, there's a strategy called cost segregation, which can accelerate depreciation on that property. You need people that can do an engineering study on it. That's people behind me. Um, I have a number of other different strategies, and I'm also linked with Al on the crypto stuff. I'm done. 303-817-995.
Say your number again, Steve. 303 8157 9954. That's chocolate tea, he's speaking there. <laughs> Richard, go ahead. Hello, my name is Rich Gostinick. I'm the CEO of Green Diamond Tiger in North America. We have plants in Europe and Scandinavia, and we're about to open up plants here in the United States. I uh, I specialize in manufacturing. We have a retreaded, uh, think a retreaded, remolded tire. It's a tire for passenger light truck, medium duty commercial vehicles. And uh, I need from this group. Actually, I'm here. I am Mr. Shemek's chauffeur on the way home. <laughs> and I'm proud and privileged to be that. Phone number. 303-808-7280. Thank you very much. So do you provide chauffeur services for everyone? You have to pick in advance. I want to get up a little bit briefly. You can't do anything briefly. I just want to say about Rich here. They think the best no tires in the world. As a matter of fact, we're on a contract right now with the uh, United States Postal Service, but they know they make the best slow tires in the world. They want to put them all on all the U.S. post office vehicles that are in the heavy snow areas and the East Coast as well as here. And they're doing a deal with a stock option where you could uh, buy in for as little as 10000 all the way up to $25 million. So, you know, if you want to get into that, that contract with postal is going to be $20 million or more. So $20 million, so, you know, it's a really good company. It's been around for a long time. The patent is from Iceland, and uh, they've been here in New York. They're building a factory in New York, and one here in Pueblo, Colorado. All right, Miss Lisa just said you guys keep going to the bar to order that little red green thing. Remember, green, I'm thirsty. Green, I'm hungry. You don't have to go next door. They'll come to you. That man right there will take good care of you. I promise. Andrew. He's got all guys. All Andrew. guys. Phone number. Oh, uh, my number, I'll tell you when I, when I call. It's going to be past okay. me. Number, so. okay. Miss Sherry, she's my board of advisor with a row of the locks for mm -hmm. ugly thorns. Here she is, Miss Sherry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My name is Sherry Craig. I am Ascend of Real Estate. My job is to help you go through life transitions and build wealth through real estate. Uh, I've been a residential real estate broker and a landlady, um, mostly on the long term rental investment. Seven two zero two nine nine fifty one forty nine. Wow, seven no seconds and no <laughs> seven seconds. Right. That's how you do it. All right, Mr. Bruce. Uh, Bruce Blake, I'm a realtor for Sherry. Uh, love home, first time home buyers. Just sold my first flip, and it was really extensive. So if anybody's doing their first flip, I can give a lot of guidance. Our second flip is probably going to need help with galvanized plumbing. So if anybody has any experience in that, I would love to hear about it. Thank you. 302 563 9116. Thank you. Eight seconds to spare. We've got a good trend coming here. All right, bro. Uh, Juliet. Yeah, nice Let's do it. I, again, I talked him into doing this. All right. So I'm Shauna Green, uh, owner of Insurance Solutions. And we offer auto pump commercial. And life insurance. Um, so I can help you at the very beginning of your process, all the way to the end when you're starting to retire and you want to consider annuities, IULs, IRAs, all the things. So, and we are also um, in many, many states. So if you need some uh, one of your properties out of Colorado, we can help you with that. Phone number. Oh, no. He's going to get back. <laughs> Yeah, you're not back. Right. Yeah, if you got, if you got a bag, you got their number. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, this well, is the pilot read. I'm going to be back. It's going to be a little bit of my wife. Um, I also consult on Ralston. So, if you, you, I've been a part of a uh, little over 250 different restaurant remodels and from the ground up. So, if you have a friend or you have somebody that's interested in building a restaurant, I can probably. Help them talk them out of it. <laughs> so <laughs> let me know. Look around. My phone is in back. <laughs> That's funny. All right, my Valentine's Day, Miss Tracy. 
I'm Tracy. Uh, I specialize in poly animal welfare. And from, I work for Denver Animal Protection. Uh, I can provide to the group poly knowledge on what's going on with uh, evictions and how you handle it from people having animals in the, uh, that perspective. Uh, my phone number is 303 uh, okay, give that again real slowly. 303. Uh, 303. Uh, 303. Uh, 303. Uh, 303. Uh, if you come to the Rig Clubhouse, you've been there with me almost every Wednesday night. So, Kay and our friend never could get her to come on stage, never could get her to talk. I got her not only in the room, but I got her up on stage and I bothered her. So. And if you come to Clubhouse, you'll find out what the terms are. <laughs> Mr. Drew! I, I think I need to practice my speech because I've never been cut off um, for the 30 seconds. I watch these guys every, every time. Box tech, you learn a lot. Let's <laughs> get my spiel out. Uh, <laughs> Sir Robin Gaffert, I work for Phoenix Loans. Uh, we can buy money, uh, money for your fix and flip and buy an old rental. Um, we are no points, no fees. We. Uh, we're strictly a percentage base, so not uh, very easy to work with. Uh, no credit check, all assets are Nine seven ten. Six four seven two. There you go. The first time you've been cut off. How about that? Thank you. Congrats. 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 The first time we're on it. Miss Loretta, come out and do it. Um, and then what I need to know is actually take action on the money and the reason. And I also am looking for a property manager. 303 909 One second, Sparrow. Miss Lynn Hurst. Oh, that's the name. I'm going to wait until you stand up. Go. Lynn Hurst with uh, Gap Housing. Uh, I build affordable housing for seniors, vets, workforce housing, LBGTQ. You name it, I can build it. Uh, I can build anywhere. This is what my communities look like. They're modular houses. Right now, I'm working with Dove Creek Subdivision down in the Four Corners area. So I will be looking for financing and possibly investors. Um, so please let me know about that. And uh you get any that? 303 579. Nine six three zero. Three oh three five seven nine nine six three zero. I used to hate this field, but now I'm having fun with it. <laughs> <laughs> Is that something you're gonna have Tim take on? Katie finally rubbed off. Katie was in the belt. Katie had a little I got some better being a little thing. Back here by Miss Loretta. I'm Simon. I'm a fund manager, an investor. So a little um, Just Both kind of listening point. to good ideas, and um, thankfully, um, been invited by Manfred, and looking forward to hearing what he has to say about uh, investing. <laughs> 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 10 seconds. All right. My name is Christine. I'm here visiting from Florida. And came here with a plan hoping to learn some new ideas. Call them. So my name will buy land in Florida. 786 8584. Thank you. Mr. Clapp, I think I just met at the John Fisher's Breakfast Club Saturday. Welcome, brother. My name is Clive. Um, I specialize in the heat auction and fix and flip. Um, I'm looking forward to the for I'm hoping that some of you with knowledge will be brought out on the So, I'm looking forward to the network. The network is My number is 720618. All right, thank you, brother. Thank you, sir. Another John Fisher breakfast, regular Mr. Keys. You got to do your slogan in there. 
Go. Okay, uh, how, you, how you guys doing? Uh, I'm Gary, Colorado Mortgage Loans. Uh, worked a lot with investors over the years since the crash, especially. And now it's getting about that time again. I think we got a window of opportunity here with sellers working with us. So one to four units, residential. Uh, it's really my specialty. My email, my key to close. So let me be your key to your next closing. My number, 303-588. Three, four, three, three, and I, I made it. That's good. He's in his head going, three, two, one. We have half the powerhouse of the Clemens team here tonight. Mom, are oh, you going to throw it to Tim first? All right, Mom's going to throw it first. Their daughter would be here, but she just had a grueling week. Everybody could send her kind and warm vibes. She spent a week in Maui. So. <laughs> So I'm Nicole Clements, and my family and I, we own Colorado Greenwich Rentals. So we own Airbnbs, and we also property manage Airbnbs for investors. And then I use these Airbnbs as midterm rentals uh, to house people relocating to the area. I mostly specialize in helping Californians move here. I'm sorry, but that's just something. Oh, that's They're making me a lot of money, so... Um, so I helped Californians move out here. I sold $17 million worth of real estate last year. I've only been in the business two years. I'm killing it. I got selected as a hospital ding, ding, ding. for a great, 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 suitable host book. So it's launched as a national, if you guys want to join us. My number is 970-430-9451. And I definitely help you. So. All right, Tim, get fill in what you missed out. Go. Yeah, so I'm Tim Clements. I'm your husband. Pretty much just help her run the business. Number you can call a little louder. Sorry. She said what she said. Call her. Nine seven zero four three zero nine four five five. All righty. And our newest member, which we love new members, Miss Jen. Hello. My name is Jen Corbis. With Surf Pro, and we specialize in mitigation and construction cleanup. We also do cleanup things like hoarding and crime and some of the stuff that you might not think of. I'm looking to connect with property managers and what I can provide. I like to have coffee. I'd like to even jump on a Zoom meeting and learn a little bit more about what you're doing and what you're looking for. I've done a lot of you working up and down the block range. And most of the time, I, I don't know if you may want to. Um, 237178811. Right. Jim Dixon, first time here, but I'm a real quick I'm also an investor in fixing flips. I feel a louder, please. I like to do a lot of creative financing with fixing flips and that sort of thing. Uh, out of state investments, too. Um, Airbnb and that sort of thing. So I'm looking to uh, do a sort for private lenders, um, providing resources and stuff like you said. Phone number is 303 653. One nine five two. All righty. One of my favorite members. She's a sharp. She's doing it the best of all. She keeps bringing quality people in here. Oh, shut up. I get to talk a lot. Keeps bringing people in here. And I'm fixing to go to deal with her, so I'm really excited. Miss Nicole. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, everyone. We have a mature rental in Erie and a long term rental out of state. Getting ready to purchase our, our first Oxford house up in Loveland and a, uh, our, our next split. So I'm also a real estate investor helping other, or a real estate agent helping other real estate investors with on market MLS and HUD homes. My phone number is 720 So is that what you're looking for? Jeez, right. Thank you. Yep. Artie, go ahead. Yes. Uh, having to pay my past overdue dues, by the way, Artie Gilbert, PMC Holdings. I have to read the at the back door. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a pleasure to talk about a new way to build an affordable house at well under $150 a square foot. And uh, so excited to showcase what we're going to be able to do with affordable housing issues in this state. So thank you for allowing me to take what ended up being the And I'm looking forward to having the presentation. My phone number is 
Right, sir. Eight seconds to spare. Right. And normally I would cheat and I'd be able to call out all our first time visitors because I have a list of names right here. But tonight, Miss Sherry has them over here. And so, again, if you didn't come see Sherry and get a name tag and tag, you need to do it for you leave. So, based on that, I think we got a husband and wife team back on a water cooler. And you each get time. Yeah. Enrique Suarez, I'm temporarily unemployed at the sophomore test engineer. <laughs> Uh, my wife and I, we own a, we own a build, a, a buy and hold here in Denver, and, and we just bought our first Airbnb in uh, San Antonio last year. It's kind of holding on there. We're not doing really anything with it, but, you know, we're learning. Um, I'm, I've dabbled in wholesaling, <laughs> I'm, I'm creating financing. I'm hoping I don't have to go back to my W-2 and somehow get into real estate. If you guys have any openings and you want some, <laughs> you want, I'm open. But, yeah, I'm an open book. I'm learning to learn, and I just... I want to get things done. So my number is 303 808 643. All right. And you get time to. Oh, God. I'm Lydia Suarez, a real estate agent. I've been here for years. For my they, they can do it. Um, yeah, I would do a lot of time. We've done a couple of clips on our own. Um, I didn't know what this was. He just told me we have, we're going to a meeting tomorrow night. And I said, okay. And so here I am. My number is 303-717-5499. At least he didn't say, I, I've got our Valentine's Day. It's going to be a surprise, right? <laughs> Guys, you want to do it again? Yeah. On a personal level? Hey guys, uh, I'm Dave Myers. I uh, work for Many Builds as well. I uh, specialize in lending, um, primarily hard money. Uh, however, I did just have the state exam, so I'll be breaking into renting out some mortgages as well. Um, looking forward to just networking with everyone. Uh, phone number is 541 982 9102. Thanks, Laura, again. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, uh, it's uh it's me again, Jeremiah. Sorry for talking too much, but uh specialize uh predominantly what I like to do with many builds is I specialize in acquisition and finding wholesale properties. I like to run the numbers before you guys get there. So it makes sense oh, to you waste your time driving the 35 minutes and then traffic and it ends up being a total bus. So that's kind of what I specialize in. What I have and what I can provide as well is at the moment okay. I am shopping out a list of foreclosure properties. I'm looking for uh -huh. at the moment who have the ability to take on the 900 to one million dollars foot rate. We had an individual that recently uh default on some loans and those uh properties ended up in my life. So feel free to ask me about properties. I have quite a few to sell at the moment and I'm happy to help. All right, all right. <laughs> Nine six zero one two five five. And because I don't have my sheet, there's three faces, but they look great. But you don't have to introduce yourself. <laughs> Good evening, everyone. My name is Vice Meyer. I am a lender with First State, specializing in the real estate side. I'm also a real estate investor. What I need from this group is this contacts, referrals, and this year at the end of June, trying to build out my network. What I can provide is out of the box financing solutions. We specialize in, uh, especially when it comes to self employed borrowers, we can work with those. And my phone number is 571 334 9367. All right, look at that. Perfect time. Uh, and young lady, you know, everybody gets the talk. Hi, everyone. My name is I don't really I can provide to you. Thank you for all information. Uh, my phone number is 303-336-2140. Hi, everyone. I'm Jason Atkins. I'm the Prince of Manfred. He invited me, so I'm happy to be here. I'm also happy to learn. I am um, new to all this and eventually one of my properties, and I'm just happy to uh, participate and find out all the information you have to share. My number is 917-690-7540. Mm -hmm. All right, Mr. Paul, one of our members from way back during the evening. Hi, my name is Paul Jones, and I'm in mm -hmm. uh, the, the short term rental and mid term okay. rental space. And I can help oh. with uh, tenant problems if anyone has those as well. Uh, my phone number is 303 746 0427. Any unused time, I'll get back to Alex. You, you, you locked out. I had my phone. Yes, sir. 
All the way from the UK, probably got to travel the fathers to be here. I am an investor from London originally, but now I have a computer in Denver. My number is 70 euros, 96, 85, 86, and I'm looking forward to bringing it to Denver. Thanks, sir. Thanks, sir. 12 seconds to prepare. Let's see. He's going to have a hard time getting, I can't see his name, Dex. We'll let him do it all. Hi, everybody. My name is Nick. Um, I specialize in project and installation construction. So on our home buying side of the company, Bun Hill Properties, um, I run all the projects, our fixed cliffs, uh, hot tops. And then we also work with one more of the investors on the renovation. So uh, pretty much start to finish. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. My phone number is 720 340 6983. Thank you, thank you. I do know this next couple. They've been around from the early days. You might want to go to the ladies first. Let's do... No. No? <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to go with the old guy first. Mr. Anthony Chara. Hey, I'm Anthony Chara with successclasses.com. Successclasses.com. Oh, no, there's all, the there's all kinds of classes, too. specifically on apartment investing. We also have asset management classes, deal structuring classes, due diligence mm -hmm. classes, mm -hmm. and we have funds, short term rental funds, mm -hmm. longer map funds, and apartment mm -hmm. funds. And actually, the investing, it's uh, well, phone number 303 745 303-745-5525. Thanks. And he's got five seconds, so I'm going to talk about him about five or maybe ten seconds. Yeah. Uh, Dave and I, we partnered went through his course. We had everything he and Sue offered. If you're even thinking about getting into multifamily, that's the one. I've been in a lot of classes in my years. I won't say how long that is, but I've been in a lot of classes. I love how he teaches because he doesn't move on to the next chapter unless everybody moves. Mm. And he, once you get in there, he aligns you with a power team of people that you may not have a deal, but they got a deal. You're, you're great to get along and join the ride. And I've done some of those ones. Thank you for being here. And his mother. Leave your cell phone off. Miss Sue. Hi, everyone. I'm Sue Lee. I'm the Chapter 7 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 um, just, oh, that's right. Part of the business. And my number is 303 745 And I also, um, when he says he has some other advanced classes, I teach the asset management. Great team. Great team. Yeah. All right, young lady. Again, somebody I don't know because I'm coming to teach you. Mm -hmm. Good evening. I'm Sudan Cavalier. Like I've been working for over 10 years consistently. Mm -hmm. and I've been working for over 10 years. Just... First visit, happy to be here. My number is 885 Thank you, ma'am. Nine seconds. And look at this, guys. You got to wear sunglasses this day. This is another one of my board members just today. He's one of the crazy guys that is said, yeah, I'll go to police. We do so. Yeah, I don't know what I'm in for. Anyway, Dave mm -hmm. Mancinkis, uh, my company is, uh, I have two companies, Land on MBA mm -hmm. and Mile High Rural Land. I specialize <laughs> in flipping mm -hmm. rural, raw, vacant land. Uh, my company, Land on MBA, will teach you how to do that for to buy and sell property for buy it for 30 cents of a dollar sell for however much you can get for it. Um, and uh, what I need from the group um, is right now, I need a uh, referral for a water attorney. And a road for so, um, yeah, I mean, don't think a piece of number 720 759 8578. One little uh, good advice if you ever said, Hey, let's go scout some land, and it's certainly, I don't care if you guys a Jeep, don't go with it. You're never going to let that down. You know, we had to have a floor pull out a Jeep out of the ditch. <laughs> and dummy me didn't take a picture of them like this. <laughs> Here's another guy that's more iconic. He's more iconic than ironic, Mr. Ross Hare. <laughs> yes, my name is Ross Hare, and I do spell my last name H A I R. 
Um, I think the hardest thing about losing my hair was I had to develop a personality. I've known Manfred for a very long time, so great to see you again. And I've known Anthony and Sue for a very long time, so great to see them again. And then I'm a real estate broker, an investor-friendly agent, mainly with land in Boulder County. And I, but I did just start a newsletter for real estate agents, for investor-friendly agents at rosshair.com. 303-803-3242, investor-friendly agents at rosshair.com. Thank you, Rosh. Mr. Bill, coming all the way from Highland, who drove farther in Highland Branch? Oh, okay, all right. Sorry, I got some That's actually Fort Collins today. So. We got Fort Collins today. Take away, Mr. Bill. Uh, my name is Bill Smith, just one of Jim's students with Invest Success. Phone number, area code 970 566 5000. 970 566 5000. Thank you. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. See, when I hear him, I'll say, who? When I say, Bill, so. Bill. That's going way back. If you, newbies, if you haven't noticed, we actually try to have a lot of fun here. We don't make a lot of money doing this meeting, so we try to have fun. We love our frolic crew. We love our regulars that come, but that's how we do it. And God, we may have to do the timer more often. We've actually got plenty of time for Mr. Mayor. He mentioned the uh, Invest Success. And we talked about the John Fisher Breakfast Club. Who does not know about the John Fisher Breakfast Club? Everybody knows. Okay. We just had it, so you missed out on a great time. We had about 55, I think, people last month. We had about 70-something people. It's a great thing. With the, with the market going up, down, Tim's waving a red flag on. I told you so. I told you so about the market. Come go to that. It's the second Saturday of every month. And we do uh, invest success. We do uh, real estate investing. We teach you how to, from I think I want to invest to help you find it, help you fund it, help you fix it, help you flip it, and build properties. It's a 12 month course. We teach you from the beginning to the end. We walk you through it. And then we start over again and do it again. We have meetings every other Monday. This is one of our alumni. So I'm going to let you hear from her. I'm going to shut up, let you hear from her. Maybe talk nice to him. Hey, good morning, and if you need to know, buddy, the way we seen here was uh, my favorite oh, students who uh, says I was after the lunch to do something. Uh, do something for me, so he's a he did a uh, program in 2017. I think he said that. Five years. Uh, you went through the program and how was it? It was a great program. Thanks, Tim. You did all the hard work teaching us. <laughs> we uh, have flipped probably over 40 houses now. We've done three in Tennessee and one and a half mm -hmm. in Arizona mm -hmm. and tons in Denver, and we love it. So it's turned into a fun fashion. Cool. Is it really a hobby? <laughs> 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 so I think you can out there. Yeah. Um, and you are also a realtor. Uh, who are you with? My Ohio Luxury Real Estate. Okay. So she lists and helps with uh, that kind of different things on these flips. Um, what has been the one thing that you took away from the program that really made a difference? Definitely the flow of the flip and how you kind of start from start to end. Um, really learning to get good contractors. That was a good one. And then I think learning how to talk um, properties <laughs> with and about the MLS was something that was used to be I always had the MLS, so I didn't have to go that far, but uh, those were really great tools. Well, thank you, Katie. Um, she's definitely one of the favorites of this process. I want to compare a few with your story now. And now you're personally at the other side of the but we got you through it and, and look at you now. And, and you tell me your plan today was to do what? That's fantastic. That's why we do this program. So thank you guys for listening and, and hearing. And Katie, thank you very much. Really appreciate you. And let's talk to you guys on the next slide. 40 half, over 40 flips in five years, <laughs> over three states, and she will retire by 40. And she, I don't know how old she is, but I don't ask lady her age. But I think she's well on her way. We've got a lot of other success stories about it. We love 
getting in there and passing deals off. We had a class last month or last night. We had 15 people in the house. It was going through construction. All the walls torn down. And one of the ladies was like, this deal is so good. Why don't you take it? It's like we get all these deals and we give them to our students so you're successful. So you can learn all of it. Now, if we go to a house and everybody in there goes, oh, it's really great, but I don't want it, maybe we'll pick it up. But our, our goal is to get our students flipping houses. We had two guys join in December, the end of December, and by the end of January, both of them has had has houses under contract, and we have projects started. So we have fun. We love it. All right. There we go. You all can hear me, I'm sure. Uh, any of you have been here before? I did a forecast here in August, and I'll show you some of my predictions then and how we did. Uh, just to give you some background. <laughs> what the hell is wrong with you? Yeah. Anyway, I want to get on the uh, plane. I said I've been a senior investment advisor speaker for Manhelm International and also FIOPSI, which is the International Real Estate Federation professor, and also the only one to receive both FIOPSI and NAR CIP as instructor of the year. Been advisor for Sentin. Senate was now Reology and I was called by Banker of Century 21 and ERA and Brookfield Real Estate Services, Royal Page Canada. In 1995, I purchased the master franchise rights for Remax in Germany. Nice residual income there. Uh, owner and regional director. And also 2010, Colorado, Wyoming, CCIM Commercial Real Estate Chapter President. And CCIM is sort of a PhD in commercial real estate. And uh, so I was president of the chapter here. I also did one chapter in Houston, Texas, and also instructor for the real, World Real Estate Summer and Global Education Course Developer in 2022. And I've been since 2012 on the board of directors of our family or orphanage, which is our give back where we've built villages in Mexico in uh, Vietnam and Africa uh, where we start with a soccer field and then on each side we have housing and then on the top we have uh, production work all right and uh, when people the only thing they have to do they get the housing for three they get the job for three on the bottom side where the other soccer goal is we um, provide uh, legal services medical etc so the only requirement for people to come and move there and get a house for free, get a job for free, is that they have to adopt at least two children out of an orphanage. Because we feel for children to have a decent start in life, they need to have a two-parent household rather than be in an orphanage. So I've been working on that since 2012 as one of my good things. <laughs> Just a little background on how I get my information for those that don't know, because some who have seen all of my forecasts, they know all this. I follow the trends throughout the year. I used to teach in 78 countries around the world, so I have boots on the ground in almost every country in the globe. And so I work from the macro down to the micro, and I've developed those kinds of uh, contacts over time and for over 25 years, including publications that I look at, which are like The Economist, which all of you should get access to because it shows you uh, the GDP for all the different countries, especially in the beginning of January. So that's really helpful. And Globe Street News under globestreet.com and also Denver Business Journal for Local. As I said much of it is just people that I've known for years that send me information in terms of what their economies are doing. Now, anyway, so here are the top 12 uh, takeaways that I'm going to give you today. Starting with the economic business, uh, outlook for business, both global, U.S., and Colorado. Then we uh, drill it down here to Colorado, business job growth, population growth projections related to supply and demand, commercial price changes in 23, uh, residential changes, interest rate increases in the rest of 23, 2023, how often, how approximately, how much. And then seven, yeah, inflation, when will it reduce, by how much? And I did a seminar on that in August here, August 9th. And uh, 
I've got some of the slides from back then to show you how close I was then. That's additional pools of money for you for your investments that some of you might not know about, many of you others do. And then proven actions and how you can do best to use this data that I'm going to give you to do more deals, whether that's business deals or whether that's real estate deals, any of that. And then how to apply the economic indicators that I'm showing you to get more uh, clients in both residential and commercial deals. Because uh, you won't always be ahead of the curve and that people realize you have the most up-to-date information. That's why they should be using you. And then the last part is cryptocurrency, which I'm going to have Al talk about a little bit on that last slide. And self-driving vehicles and climate change, proven uh, actions uh, that so you can use this info on interest rates, et cetera, to do more deals. So that's what we're going to be covering here, those 12 items. Uh, the global outlook, as I said, we're in a global economy. Global economy affects regional countries, local. What happens in one area affects other areas. Although, you know, we have been, uh, business cycles, obviously, all over the world, and they're not cycling at the same time. So, you know, some of you, have, like myself, where I have global investments, so that I have them in different parts of the globe. So if I need access to money, I've got some that are on the high end versus others that are on the low end. But, um, but that, so, you know, you have to understand that and we'll go from the macro to the mount, uh, down to, uh, to the micro. Uh, most of the global economies are in a downturn and a number of them most likely will have a recession here in 2023. But I think differently in terms of the U.S. Uh, because the economy has been booming both through 21 and 22, and will be positive in 23. But this is mostly overlooked by the media. They concentrate mostly on inflation, gas prices, egg prices. This is why consumer confidence is much lower than what the actual business numbers indicate of how good we are. And so that's part of the problem. Years ago, when I was doing seminars in England, and the press actually drove it down into recession because that's all they talked about. And you know the public lost confidence and wouldn't buy. Uh, so that's one of the problems we have with ours because the press here, you know, like most press around the world, if it bleeds and leaks, so they'd rather tell you the negative rather than telling you, you know, the positive that's going on. So that's part of it. Uh, I predict that GDP 22 would rise 6.5 to, uh, to 7%, but it was actually even higher than that. It was actually 9.2% for 2022. Uh, but, uh, you know, things are going down a bit, but I still think in terms of GDP that we will probably be in the 5 to 7% range increase in GDP here in 2023. So I'm still fairly confident as I was here in August. That's U.S.? US this is, yes, US. the US GDP, yes, not the global, US ones. Playing boards at 12.50, so I gotta get, I mean, at 12 o'clock, so I gotta get out of here. But Anthony knows about Belize, I don't know about Anthony. Anthony knows about Belize, I'm gonna go learn about Belize. It mainly we're gonna go have fun, but while we're there, yes, we gotta run a car, gonna drive around the checklist and stuff. Uh, so you're in Belize City? Belize City, just northeast of there. And we, I've got to run. I'm gonna to go to cave tubing, zip lining, scuba diving, driving, driving, get lost. Wow. I'm there for eight days. Sounds like a terrible time. Terrible time. I know. Snow's coming tonight. I just hope I can be in the air before the snow hits. So. Nicole's just to the top, but she just talked about a deal with Oxford House. This is an awesome group where you get to go in and get a group home. A company comes in Oxford House. They will rent your house. And they will put people in your house that are getting a second chance, a second start. I'm very excited to be a part of Nicole's deal. Uh, we did a clubhouse chat on it a few months ago. It was very, it was very enlightening. There were several people on the call that it's by the end of the clubhouse chat, they're like, a couple of guys, I'm changing my entire business model. I'm going to rent stuff for sober homes. So, Vince. Uh, Oxford House, and now Nicole's going to be up here next month, March. We're going to be talking about Oxford House. 
uh, in sober home. Is that the fourth or the eleventh? What's it say? Or or that can't be the second Tuesday of the month. I have a typo there. It's the second Tuesday of the month. We're always here the second Tuesday of the month. <laughs> How long is that been in there? All right, very good, Steve. You get you get you get kudos tonight. Moving forward, moving forward, moving forward. Come on, click. All right, we'll do this right here. Second Tuesday is the fourteenth. Four, fourth Tuesday is the fourteenth. Right, can we go back. Okay, Oxford on fourteenth. I missed the one. Cash flow. Who knows cash flow? It's like the monopoly on steroids. We meet usually right back in that corner or this table. We meet in here. It's even less informal or less formal. We have fun. We play. We play together to win. If you've never played, don't worry. Come. We all play together to win. Somebody will win. They'll just or go bankrupt. They'll just run right back in the game until the system. Okay, it's two hours. We've had enough. It's fun, fun, fun. It's free. Just come and be. We don't even have. We don't even care about tickets. I'm sure. Okay. My battery, man, could you kill that March battery? or February? Now that is March. Okay. Because February, I'm still going to be in the lease. <laughs> For house hacking. There's about house hacking. And, uh, and one hand goes up there. This is where you buy a house. You probably don't want to live in it. But this young man started out when him and his girlfriend, they got a house on FHA loan. The rule is what? Your intent is to live there one year. He brought tenants in. They rented it after a year. He picked the favorite renter. He says, okay, you're now the house RA, whatever. He went and bought another house in the FHA loan, repeated it, repeated it, repeated it, repeated it. In five, I think it's five years. I didn't say how long. In five years, he equaled his W-2 income with passive income from house action. He continually bought a house. He bought a bigger house. He bought a bigger house. He bought a bigger house. He's going to be. We also had a really great clubhouse chat on that. So if you if you don't clubhouse and go to Rick Clubhouse, you can go through all these things. Hey, look, it's working out. Who knows Brian Financial and Kevin? Kevin's going to be here and talk about a little. If, if you ask anybody else from Pine Financial, they're like, that's a Kevin thing. That's a Kevin thing. They won't talk about it. They do hard money lending, but also they have a fund where you can be the bank. You can go and put money into their fund. And they'll use that money and lend it out to all these fix and flip deals. He's going to come and talk about that passive income and capital preservation. We've got this scheduled for June, but this may be pushed back. Uh, in best success, Tim and I are working on. Anybody know the magazine Realty Four One One? It's a nationwide magazine. They hold expos all over the country. Tim and I are going to Philly in March for a big expo. We're going to talk about. Our new franchise opportunity, which will come up. I'll tell you about that in a minute. Anyway, we're going to Philly, and then we're going to try to bring 411 to Denver. So Joe may not be speaking on the 3rd of June. We may move into August, but Joe's going to come. He's going to talk about all the different ways you use hard, use hard money. How many agents we got in here? You can get CE credits if you come that night. Uh, so that, that date may change. It may be pushed back to August. Hey, we're in a, a brewery. They're open. They don't usually kick us out until about 10 o'clock. There's JH, my parking lot buddy right there. Actually, he's my Lyft driver tonight. <laughs> he's going to whisk me away here very shortly to the airport. But you guys can stay in network. Oh, one other thing. In your bags, it wasn't all chocolate or a little card. There was some little wood pieces in there. Check your bag. Don't throw it away. It's actually been called me money. Put in your nickel. The only, the only, if you haven't used it yet, put it in your pocket, but bring it back to the next meeting. Every bag? No, some bags. Some bags. That would be. Some special bags. These are good when you're in ring meetings, or if you catch me in the bar and you hey, Jim's here, I got a wooden nickel. Other than that, I am very glad you guys came. Thank you for coming on uh, Valentine's. And, and I'll do, I, I didn't plan this. The man for mentioned joining, joining, joining. And you did, guys, you guys did give up kind of a special night to come be with us. So if you're a first timer or if you're a member and you'd like to extend your membership 10% off tonight, if you talk to me before 9 o'clock, 10% off. On either a new membership or a renewal.
Uh, you know, it's true. It's February 14th, 14% off. I love you guys. I say it every month, but I love you guys. We tried to have fun tonight. That's why Romeo and Juliet are here. They're, they're, like you say, they, 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 they love you to death, and that's when the life insurance kicks in. Thank you for being here. Thanks.